Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Right next to our road again. I am actually back uh, just off Dwyer Hill Road, uh, heading west towards Carlton Place. I came here earlier in the year and I took a couple of shots of uh, this dead forest. And uh, I wanted to come back because uh, all the leaves are gone off the trees now and all the bulrushes in the foreground here I figured would look pretty good. It's three o'clock in the afternoon, the sun is still pretty high and it is kind of still overexposing things. And uh, I noticed in the area that there's hemlock growing. I think that's what it's called, where they turn um, yellow in the fall after all the other trees have lost all their leaves these trees lose their needles um, but uh, they're off in the distance there's some way over there as well and <laughs> I wanted to fly the drone and as soon as I powered everything up it told me I wasn't logged in I had this problem before I think it was actually earlier in the year now I haven't flown the drone in a while, but uh, that should, still shouldn't have anything to do with it because I logged into my account there about three weeks ago. So I don't know why it's telling me that I'm not logged in and it, when it does that, it sets your max distance and your max height. So I couldn't really fly it anywhere. I flew it up, got a bit of a panorama of the area, but still I'm a little pissed off about that. But oh well, what are you gonna do? There's so much traffic here, it's like I'm waiting for a moment when cars aren't driving by that I can actually talk. <laughs> Anyways, uh, across the road, they're not bulrushes, I don't know what they're called, but they have this fluffy texture to them and they're all grouped together. And I tried taking a picture of some of them with the sun behind me, they looked okay. I walked across the street and oh my God, the pictures looked stunning, like incredible on the back of the LCD with the sun shining through them. Oh, I can't wait to see what those look like on the uh, system at home. And uh, once I finish with post-production, but uh, yeah, they just looked incredible. I was, so this was not a wasted trip. And I am planning to go on the other side of the highway. I found on Google Maps a stand of uh, scotch pine. So I'm gonna go over there and see if I can get some compositions. It's prop private property, there's a fence, I can't get over the fence and I'm not about to jump over it. So I'll see if I can try and get some compositions there but for oh, the pictures I got over here were just, on the back of the LCD I was blown away just by how they looked. But uh, yeah, I'm really bummed that I can't fly the drone. So. Yeah, so there's some hemlock right there, you can see. I wanted to fly the drone over them down that way, but obviously I couldn't do that. Yeah, this time of year, and with winter coming, it's really hard to find a composition. This area, actually, I'm, I'm planning on coming here in the winter to try and get some shots to see what it... It's going to have to be a cloudy day, though, because if it's a sunny day, everything will be so overexposed, so... There's no way I'm gonna be able to do that on a sunny day in the winter. It's gonna to have to be an overcast day, but uh, just standing here looking at it, it just looks amazing. Okay, I'm gonna head over to the stand of Scotch Pine. Hit the thumbs up, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video. Talk to you later, bye.